Okay, so we're going to do electron configuration. We are for, first going to do gallium. So GA is gallium. It is in group 13, and its atomic number is 31. So we need our exponents to add up to 31. What we're going to do is we're going to start with our first arrow. So this is arrow 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Okay, so these are our arrows. You have to go completely through arrow 1 before you can move on to arrow 2. So we're going to start with arrow 1. We have 1s. And notice our exponents up here. We can have two exponents, uh, a maximum of 2 for the s orbital. You can have 6 for p orbital, 10 for d, 14 for f. So we need two of them because we need our exponents all to add up to 31. So we're done with arrow 1. Arrow 2 is 2s. Again, we're going to need all two of them in that shell. So we're going to use all two. Now we move on to our third arrow. It's going to be 2p. Notice we can have 6 in our p orbital, so we're going to need all six of them. Then we're going to go to 3s. We're going to use all two of them. I'm going to move it down just so you can see on the video. Uh, after 3s, we're done with our third. Now we're going to go to 3p. We can have six in there. And then we're going to go to 4s2. Now we're done with 1, 2, 3, and 4. Now we go on to our fifth. So our fifth arrow, we start with 3D10. Now we're going to count, see how many we're at, just so we know. So we have 2, 4, 10, 12, 18, 20, 30. You add the exponents up, we're going to get 30. Okay, now we have 30. We need 31, so we need to go after 3D10. We go down the arrow to 4P and we will need one electron. So if you add up all your exponents right now, you should get 31, which is the atomic number of gallium.